Hello, podcast listeners. This is the legendary podcaster, Reverend Steve. You've probably heard my podcast, The Pope on Film. You've probably heard my other podcasts, uh, The Pope Adjacent to Film, The Pope Near Film, and The Pope Who Wishes to Once Again Get on Top of Film and Ride That Bitch Until I Orgasm. Well, today, we've got a special podcast, D&D, with your hosts, Deanna and Destiny. I have Destiny. an important question. <laughs> yeah? You ever try to swallow Dramamine dry? It's hell. I don't think I've ever tried to swallow anything dry. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Steve said that uh, we should talk about my anxiety. Awesome! Uh, I had an idea that we could bring up our famous discussion. About, also, about which famous discussion? So, we're talking about the, love. Oh well, um, you see, uh, who's the hottest in King of the Hill? Oh, okay. <laughs> but whichever one, we'll see if we have time. We can always talk about it another time. Yeah, yeah, okay. So I, I wish I was a little more prepared for this. I just <laughs> have some mental bullet points that I think about every day um, about the cast. And characters of the beautifully animated, uh, what is it, late night Nickelodeon TV show, <laughs> King of the Hill. Oh, about a beautiful conservative family. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I think they live in the suburbs. I'm pretty sure uh, the wife is a closeted lesbian. Yeah, and Hank sells propane and propane accessories. Mm-hmm. Bobby something else. Now let's 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 hit on each character. We'll, we'll do the, the pros and cons just, of each character. Dan and I have had this uh, ongoing argument of which King of the Hill character we think is the most uh, stereotypically hot. Now, now, let me preface this with we were limiting it originally to the four that sit out on the lawn yeah, the four and drink little... so and Not sodas. They drink so- beer. I think you were going to say soap. They drink yeah. soap, uh, which would be uh, Bill. The fat one, oh, who has beady little fucking eyes, yeah, the, the, and uh, is just sad, just yeah. real sad, real fucking sad. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's Boomhauer, who uh, doesn't mm-hmm. speak mm-hmm. English, mm-hmm. as far mm-hmm. as I'm concerned. This is this is my uh, who who turns seems to be the uh, crowd favorite when it comes to the hottest of them. It's it's the face shape. It's the it's the it's the not so boxed but the strong jaw. Because if you look, Bill does not have a jaw. Yeah, he's got your husband's chin. Shut up. <laughs> um, Which is to say none. <laughs> lack thereof. Then there's then there's Dale. Which is my uh, favorite. <laughs> he's a scrawny... Uh, Dale Gribble. Fucking loser conspiracy theorist. And I might have been into him had he had, you know, actual power to pack behind his words. Like, for example... My favorite character from the Tremors movies, Burt Gummer. Burt is my See, daddy. He's a conspiracy theorist, but he's also fucking ready for shit, and he's got guns and training, and he's ready to fucking. <laughs> Dale will just scream and run. <laughs> Scrawny little bitch. It's me, that's I'm Dale. Uh, my my wait, wait Hank. And then there's the titular Hank. Hank Hill himself. The box man. The square box man. Whoa! <laughs> Bobby! God damn it, Bobby! So, propane and propane accessories? Yeah, that's it. That's all it is. Um, and he I'm wants, gonna kick your ass! He wants to kick people's ass a lot. He wants to kick you see, your that's, ass. That's the one I'm personally attracted to the most. Probably because, and I've discussed this with uh, Natasha before, but because I have a certain number of daddy issues, <laughs> and I can go into that further. Wonder what is the number? I another need an exact time. Number of how many daddy issues? I um, mm, seventy three. Yeah, seventy three. I, I have exactly. an amount of daddy. A percentage. I have like two pounds worth of daddy <laughs> issues. I have about three large uh, movie theater soda <laughs> cups full of daddy issues. Oh, and I can get into that. Another time. I could name you lists and lists of characters that I'm into for reasons that correspond to my issues. But hey, this that's is about, a discussion for another time. This is about King of the Hill. <laughs> this is about King of the Hill. God damn it, Bobby. <laughs> 
and so the question ultimately is wait are we adding bobby to our no <laughs> he's a child okay we do not add Sorry. children that's fucking pedophilia okay. <laughs> i um, think there's some kind of like legal restriction on that you can't even talk about pedophilia can you wow you can you can talk against it no i mean talk for it oh. <laughs> I'm Why kidding. would you? <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Destiny, do I have to like break up our relationship? I have hey, to... Just because I'm into Bobby. <laughs> no, no. King of the Hill. <laughs> she's I joking. Said, he's just so sweet. She, she's. I would like to mother him. Okay, see that's in a normal. paternal manner. That's normal. That's cool. Definitely not in a sexual way. And you mean that honestly? Yeah, honestly. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, I, you think I, I am? Fuck, I just want to, because they can't see your face like I can. Even if they did, they they would probably know that I'm definitely telling you. I don't know, do you know how many fucking pedophilias there are lurking around? <laughs> pedophilias? <laughs> Pe- pedophiles? <laughs> there are on the internet? Yeah, I um, actually put our address into, uh, I don't know what it's called, it's like findpedophiles.com. Oh my god. We, like, live, I'm talking like 12, 13, just littered around our neighborhood. Oh, so sex offenders? But yeah. But we do live in the slums <laughs> of Shawnee. Is that a, is that a, I that hope that's not a, like a derogatory racial slur. Mm. No? I don't know. I know ghetto is. <laughs> King of the Anyways, Hill! Anyway! King of the Hill! The question we find ourselves asking people is um, who out of the four usually, I think we're expanding it now. Because Aunt Tasha said that she likes the uh, the, the Native American oh, guy. Oh, the Native American. What's his name? I can't fucking mm-hmm. remember. I never really Let's watched the show much. Let's just call oh. him Taji. No, it's I mean, look at, Go look it up or something. Yeah, yeah. Who's the Native American and King of the Hill? Okay. Um. I don't know. I'm. I find myself. I. I'm telling you, Dale. So there's an idea that maybe we're we're expanding it to a certain point. Yeah. The original was that we'd ask people who out of the four they thought was the hottest, and uh, there's a resounding no one for <laughs> Bill. <laughs> Zero points for Bill. Let's see. Um, Natasha said Dale if she were to be forced to pick one. If she were to be forced. Because, out of the four. Because she says Boomhauer reminds her of her brother. Dwayne Burkett. Dwayne. Dwayne. How do you love a man with the name Dwayne? <laughs> um, I think it's an honest question. What's wrong with what's wrong with Dwayne? Just ma- just say it. Dwayne. John Red John Redcorn. Woo! <laughs> Mr. Redcorn. name <laughs> terrible? <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty awful, actually. All right, so uh, we got one point for Mr. John Redcorn. We got oh, one for Hank Hill. Well, who we picked Dale. him? Oh, you. I'm first. Hank. Okay. Now, are you are you your uh, your your uh, reasoning behind Hank Hill? My reasoning, I, I mean, I I'm gonna be honest with you. This is purely from aesthetic looks. I don't know anything really about this guy except mm-hmm. that he gets angry. I think that's funny. <laughs> and he kicks his friend's asses. I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> um, God damn it, Bobby. And I don't know, I just kind of like, not quite the boxy feel itself, I guess. It's more like I just like the... He's a Minecraft character. Tip- Let's Whoa. just get to it. <laughs> oh my he God. is a Minecraft character. I don't know, he's just kind of look like typical dad status. And yeah. I'm kind of into that. He's got that beer gut. But honestly, so does Bill. Bill's got a little bit more than a beer gut. I feel like if Bill cleaned up his act and, like, stopped talking like he talks and stopped looking like he looks, I think I could jump on the Bill wagon. Maybe grew his hair back. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe use some, um, um, Bosley. <laughs> What is that? No, head on, or what it is. Something applied directly to the forehead? You remember that commercial? Yeah. Head on, applied directly to the it's, forehead. It's my real hair. It's there. <laughs> He's tugging at it. I can, I can, I can wash, wash it. it. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that so much. Oh, or tattooing God. hair on their heads. <laughs> yeah, tattooing hair on their heads because they're sad and lonely like Bill from That's sad. King of the Hill. Well, I mean, 
I find I don't have any issue with bald people. Most of my I don't have an issue with bald people too, but like you can only tattoo it so far on a 2D surface. <laughs> <laughs> Just flat. <laughs> mm. I was I heard somebody, I, I, um, I don't I don't yeah. mind bald people unless we're talking about the bald people where it's like style or cancer. Yeah. Yeah, like an aesthetic choice. Yeah. <laughs> or a I dread disease. Like the lead singer of Daughtry. Um, <laughs> Howie Mandel. Patrick Stewart. Mr. <laughs> Clean. Yeah. <laughs> Don't get me started on Mr. Clean, okay? I'm into him, too. Oh, Mr. Clean. Oh, we're not going to talk Super about Bowl that. Super commercial that came out with a mop in the floor and, like, <laughs> shake it. I was, in, I was down. I was diggy down. I was down for that. <laughs> Then there's some people who just don't work being bald. Yeah, I mean, it's like, I, I heard a joke one time. Um, I'm not going to make fun of them either. I'm just going to kind of look at their <laughs> weird head shape and yeah. move there's on. Some, oh, God, there's some people that should not be bald, like my husband. No. I don't think he has a back of skull. I, I think it's just flat. <laughs> Although, my uncle, my uncle Chris, Chris Haney, his head is a box. Is that his skull? Like, hey, no, you being my uncle. <laughs> you... And I so I don't even oh, I don't understand I don't understand the physics of it, <laughs> like what happened. But what I was saying, you interrupted me like four times. I so no, it's okay. I I heard this joke and it was uh, if you know like when people are having sex, uh, they like to tug on hair. Some people like that. But what do you do if you're going to tug on someone's hair but they're bald? And then somebody said, just smack their head. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's hilarious. <laughs> Like, like, like tiny baby smacks? No, no, no. Or like, like slap. <laughs> like slap. I mean, you like wouldn't that... in the back of the head. <laughs> yeah, you gotta, you gotta. Why are you behind them is the question. <laughs> <laughs> That's a thing. People, like, a, but... a sex thing that people do is like punch. Uh, it's like called like donkey something. But donkey you, punch? Yeah, you punch them in the back of the head and they pass out. Listen, I'm pretty sure that means you punch them in the asshole. No, but... no. My brother told me this. <laughs> Oh. My brother told me that you punch, if you punch someone back then to pass out, then that's like, I don't know, it's supposed to be good, I guess. I don't know! Mmm, euphoric. <laughs> but if you, but if you <laughs> slap him in the head, wouldn't that be yeah. like fucking the Benny Hill guy? <laughs> yes. This is Benny Hill music. <laughs> you have to play it or else it doesn't work. What'd you put on me, Bella? It says gay. It's not say gay. It didn't stick to my face because it's oily. Yeah, mine didn't stick very so well either. Our, our, what we have failed, yeah. the threshold we've failed to get over is who's the hottest? Is it Hank Hill? Is it Dale Gribble? Is it Bill? With whose last name I don't know. <laughs> Boom, how isn't Boom Hauer his last name? First name Boom, last name Hauer. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I love you, I you, man. You know what's the better question we haven't gotten into? What? <laughs> no. Who's the hottest Seinfeld character? <laughs> oh, um, God. Seinfeld. <laughs> mm, no, who's the crazy one with like the hair? Kramer. Kramer. <laughs> I always found myself like, because he seems like a conspiracy theorist. He's like racist. I think. <laughs> That's great. I don't know. I don't actually know. George Costanza. <laughs> um, <laughs> Danny. I know Danny DeVito is not part of Seinfeld. Here's the question: but Who's the Danny hottest De Danny DeVito? Oh, which Danny, Danny DeVito, DeVito is hottest? The Lorax. The Lorax. Definitely. The Lorax. So I got a thing for mustaches. I got a thing for mustaches. I don't know what it is. Bunny. Yes. Bunny. Oh. For our poll, who do you think is the hottest male King of the Hill member? Presiding silence. Do they do they have to talk? Mm. They have to be a recurring character at least. Do they, they don't have no, to no, talk? No, 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 no. I'm going. I'm going for one of the four. Um, oh, but. I like, do you have to listen to them talk? Yeah. Mm. Are, are we oh, just no. going for physical attractiveness? Yes. Yeah, we're going for, like, just aesthetic. Which plenty. Hank Hill member makes you weak at the knee? Uh, or even slightly like, anything. I, I, I'd, yeah, go, I'd go Boomhauer. 
Oh, uh, see, I told you, fucking Boomhauer is the fan favorite. I don't know why. I it's it's his it's, jaw. It's his jaw. It's, it's the, the fact that he has dot eyes. And but, if he, but if he talks, I'm gonna donkey punch him. Oh, oh my god. Wait, wait, Steve, what's yours? What your you favorite, you're the hottest Hank Hill member out of the four. Male. Male, uh, being the, Hank, the Dale, Boomhauer, or Bill. Objectively, you don't have to live with them or anything. And they don't even have to talk. See, what you're um, doing... This is Boomhauer. I'm Hank, and she's from No, Dale. it would be Boomhauer. It would be Boomhauer. Why? Oh, fucking, they're all Because he's got, he's got that, like, uh, Matthew McConaughey sort of thing. All oh, my other, fucking oh my god. god, he does! All the other guys are kind of gross. Like oh, no. Hank, Hank Hill has like weird, would have like weird, he has a weird man ass. Balls. It's like, oh my god. And then there's like the fat one, and then there's a conspiracy Why is theory he one. The but then the there's like one. that one guy that you, you like, you don't understand what he's saying, but he's he's vaguely hot. <laughs> yeah, like I mean, as hot as you can get for Hank Hill, but yeah. boom power bitches. We are team yeah. boom power. <laughs> you guys are super bitches. But see what you're doing. <laughs> what you're doing is an old call center game we used to play called who would you fuck? Oh, okay. Now you never say the title of the game out loud because you're working at a call center, but you would, would, you would just, you would just look to somebody and you would give them two alternatives and they have to pick one of them. Okay. Um, and, and, and it could be anything. It could be cartoon characters, the Statue of Liberty. And, you know, just... Who would you fuck? <laughs> like, like, I, like, I would totally fuck Sarah Palin, but if she speaks, it's over. I'm gonna donkey punch her. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> okay, Sarah Palin or a moose. Oh my god. <laughs> like, I, I would have moose to go Sarah every Palin. Time. <laughs> I'd go with the moose. <laughs> okay, so I mean, I guess if that... I just like talking about it sometimes. I guess, I guess that just settles it. I, I, I mean, politics does not enter into fucking, you know? I mean, it, yes. That, that's that's the bottom to, line on that. Yeah. Write back to us. Who do you, you, listeners who might hear this, write back oh, to us. Oh. Who do you like in the four King of the Hill? Are you boomer? Oh, have you, have you, have you, have you set up a, have you set up a show email are you yet? Are Or are you, the, <laughs> are you in the ant hill? Are you in the <laughs> Are you the hanky? Are you a hanky? Or are you a, uh, Dale. a billboy? Bill. <laughs> or are you a proud Native American? <laughs> or are you a proud Native American? I think the door looks the hottest. Or hey, 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 you might want the grandpa. Ooh. <laughs> oh, man. He's just, old, he's man. just, that's just Danny DeVito. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus yeah. Christ. That's just really angry Danny no, DeVito. Racist Southern. Oh, Danny my God. DeVito. Or, or, or. You could go the Rob Roy route. No, Rob. What's his name? I don't know. What the fuck are you talking about? Boomst? The hmm? child fiddler. We were just talking about him, Bunny. The child the, fiddler? The child? <laughs> like, like a musical prodigy? That's a... or no, do you, no, 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 do you no, touch no. his yeah. shoes <laughs> under your neck? No. <laughs> you could go the pedophile route and want the little boy. Bobby, Bobby. Roy Moore. Like Roy Moore. Yeah. Wait, we were just talking about Bobby. Yeah, we were... But I said I want I want a mother Bobby. I want him to suckle for my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> and a non-sexual, completely maternal way. Okay, Come well, here, ten year old boy. Let's see Jesus there, Christ. D yeah. this this segment of uh D D is brought is to wrapping you up. By... But let me just say, I swear to God, if any of you fuckers try and tell me that the hottest one is that one fucking loser guy that who Luann dated with uh, the with the teeth Tom Petty. with the teeth. Tom Petty. He was he was don't, voiced by don't Tom Petty. Oh really? Yeah. Don't even, don't even bring Tom that Petty shit. In. Don't Maybe. even bring that shit. Tom Petty is. <laughs> oh, the green? I died. Okay, green. green. There you go. So yeah, that are you are you a uh, are you a a Hillian? <laughs> Are you a Gribloid? A Hillian is a, a species in friggin' Zelda. Are you a Hillian? <laughs> Are you a Billboy? Are you a Gribloid? I'm calling it the the Ant Hill. <laughs> or are you a Gribble? <laughs> Boom. boom, boom, bitch. Boom, bitch. Or are you a boom, bitch? That's the real question. <laughs> Who we left out? <laughs> Or all right, that's that's all for today's D and D. 
Uh, I think where we, we don't were talk talking, about D and I think we were talking about maybe answering people's questions. So if anyone might be interested in that, uh, ask a question. <sighs> How would we'll they get in? Time. How would they get in touch with you? I don't know. You guys do all this stuff. <laughs> I don't want to give out my email. Set, oh, in set up. Deanna, set up. Or Jesse, sh- just get in touch with Steve for Bunny. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that makes a lot of sense, guys. They'll, they'll forward it to us. Yeah. Set up a new stuff. Gmail oh, account. Four five three eight zero. <laughs> right. <laughs> Oh, they're getting strange calls. <laughs> I think one of them's from wait, wait, where is your biggest fan? New Zealand. New Z- it, 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 where's our biggest fans? Yeah, uh, what is your biggest? Uh, fans? our biggest. Well, outside of America, <laughs> Vietnam is hot. Yeah. Vietnam. Yeah, we, yeah, we got go. we yeah, got some Vietnam. loyal people in Vietnam. Me is people gonna get right now. <laughs> <laughs> Bunny. <laughs> Open boobs. Bunny, did we do okay? Open boobs. Open boobs. Uh, I don't know. I was having a cigarette. You sounded okay. like you were doing yeah, great when I came back. More, more fit than Steve yeah. did. Yeah. I, I will I will find out more when I edit it. I only I only heard the ending, but I think it was shit. Okay, so we're we're <laughs> off you. All we're I do off. is produce shit. <laughs> we're off record, yeah, right? What? We're not what? like well, we're recording, but we're not doing segment. Um, okay, hey, did um did um did what are you doing? Stop fucking with my shit! Give them to me. You those are for it. my class. God damn it, Bella. Yeah, those are for here. That was for her. school. That's anyway, school um, school. did you did you get that information that I sent to Jeannie? I never got back on Facebook to see. Bunny, I'm talking to you. I, I'm I'm not sure what information. Um, I sent some uh, information to Jeannie on Facebook for you from my oh, friend. Oh, right. Yeah. I Well, I got in contact with her, and then she answered back, and I had an issue. I didn't get back to her for a bit, and I haven't heard back from her again. I don't think that they're really ready yet, you know, to actually start podcasting. So I, I mostly yeah, gave out, like, a lot of advice and shit. Froggy told me that they're like they're learning. They're just learning. They yeah. have no fucking clue. She works as a, I think she's a lawyer. She's in a lawyer's office or something. Yeah. And so, like her boss just came up with this shit, and she was telling my friend, and my friend was like, "Hey, your husband does this shit, right?" And I was like, "Well, I mean, no, <laughs> but Buddy <laughs> does." Uh, she's like, "Okay, because they don't know what the hell they're doing. They don't know what they need. They're just starting out from the <clears> ground <throat> with these podcast things, and like, so I was like, all right, well, I can give you, you know, I can pass your information along to Bunny, see yeah. what comes of it. So, I mean, I don't know. I just figured, hell, you're at home. You do the stuff for your guys' podcast, anyways. Uh-huh. If you could make a few extra bucks off of it, why not? That would be you know? great. But that is, that is also what kind of tipped the scale. Like thinking about doing that." that made me decide to uh, dig up all my old footage and stuff like that and cut it into a reel and see if I can't get any video editing jobs out there. Well, yeah, I mean, shit. You do this stuff on a regular anyways. You yeah. See if you can get paid for it. Get paid for doing what you like, you know? Yeah. So, I mean, well, I, I, I'm not doing anything anywhere. I'm not, you know, ready to go out into the real world again. You know, maybe, yeah. Maybe I don't. I have figured to. it would be something that you can do, you're familiar with, and you don't have to overwhelm yourself. Yeah. So. So I appreciate it. Thank you very much for that. Came of it. Okay. Okay. I'm ready. I've got my ready. Ready. Okay. Talking about Wally. <clears throat> yeah. Right on.